Welcome to the last episode of Sunlight's Political Money Weather Report, our weekly series on 2012 election spending. Where it's happening, who's behind it, which candidates are most affected, and of course, what we don't but should know. Here's what we're seeing in this final week for the elections. Torrents of fundraisers have been happening throughout the whole year, the heaviest in Washington, D.C., during the political conventions in Charlotte and Tampa, New York City and San Francisco. Fundraising has even extended to overseas locations such as London, Paris and Geneva, most of these for the Obama campaign. This is the first presidential election since the Supreme Court's Citizens United decision that kicked off a series of rulings that allowed unlimited, undisclosed donations through the creation of super PACs and dark money groups. It has been a cloudy year in political money spending, with outside groups spending over $1 billion in these elections. That's more than double from the 2010 elections, which was the first after Citizens United. And for a lot of that $1 billion, we will never know who gave that money and influenced our elections. Let's make sure that the next elections will have less dark money storms and more sunshine. Get informed and involved at sunlightfoundation.com.